hello. We are back. I just need to get something up. Hold on. Um. Okay, that's good. Right. Right, we're back. We're back in Soma. It's uh it's been a little bit, I think. Did we I don't think we played that all last weekend. Um unless we did and I've completely forgotten. Maybe we did. <laughs> but either way it's been a little bit. Uh but we're back. We're back in it. Um things are getting a bit scarier now. Um <laughs> Simon has entered Omnicron. Before he can ride the climate into the abyss, he needs he needs a power suit, so he'll survive the pressure. So we need to find a power suit. Um, I don't really know what happens in this place. Um, and I, as soon as I've walked in, uh, there's people whose heads have exploded. So that's that's a good start, huh? Um, <laughs> I'm getting shivers already. Hi, Swan. Hello. Welcome. Oh. I need to take some oh, deep breaths. We're going in. I apologize for the screams and whatever happens <laughs> during the session. Uh. Carrie, hello, hello, welcome. I hope you're doing well. We're loading in, guys. Oh, here we go. We we're in. Oh dear. Was that? Is this what it looked like? I think some of the graphics are a bit bugged. <laughs> but we're here. I love this. Oh, I can touch them. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Feeling good. Apart from, you know, being scared. <laughs> That's right, I couldn't hear anything, right? That's right. Oh, I already hate this. Global lockdown. Active override. Right, dive room. Oh! What? Why did it do that? I'm good though? Well, that's good. I hope so. Any goodies here? No? Nothing? A lot of goop. A lot of goop. I just need to check. Oh no, we're fine. A little upset though? No, Carrie! Why are you upset? What happened? South Pole... FB? What's FB stand for? No. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, robot repair bay? Huh? What, well, where we were? Oh. Do that to me. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Containment and dive room. I guess dive room is where we're we going. Oh, I'm 
scared. I'm scared. Hi, friend. Are you in here? Talking about the arc or what? Oh my god. Medical bay, dive room. Huh, let's just. Oh. No, this is a dead end. Oh. Oh, what? 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 Why does it do that? It always scares me. Ah! Yes, I know you're there! Please stop! <laughs> Please stop! Please. Oh. Oh. I hate it. hate everything about this. Okay. Uh, I'm scared. Uh, oh, I don't know where to go. What do, where do I go? What do I do? room. What's the storage? Any goodies? No? All locked? Anything that looks like I might be able to use it? Nope, I don't think. I don't think so. Okay, I'm scared. I hear little footsteps. I'm scared. There we go. I didn't think that was working. Uh, me playing to spend time with a friend playing games before me, right? Like in Storm. Play the bar. Uh, but I waited an hour over the time they said they would be home and they never showed up. No! I haven't heard from them at all today to see if they were needing a reschedule or, or not. So I'm not sure what is going on with them. Oh no, that's not good. Wait, so this is the dive room. That's no good, Carrie. I understand that. Maybe something happened? I don't know. Uh, this is scary. Am I going to have to run? I hope that it doesn't sneak up on you anytime soon. Yeah, I know, right? I am totally scared. But maybe we're fine. <laughs> God. I can't see shit! Oh my! Okay, it locked me in here. Hello! I hear voices. <laughs> I'm hearing voices. Why is my torch always turning off all of a sudden? Oh! Wait, I think we're good. I think we're good. Her is dead. 
This Omicron? Everything is so basic, so limited. I hope it's not the Omnitool falling apart. Okay, we need to find you a power suit. You know, so we can go into the abyss without ending up like a recycled can of soda? You think we'll find one that fits me? I mean, I'm kind of in a suit already. That's been bothering me too. You know how you were transferred from Vancouver? Toronto. From then to now. How could I forget? Okay, so we do it again. You want to send me to the future? No, you idiot. I want to transfer your mind into a new body. What? Look, we already know it can be done. We don't need to make it a big deal. It is a big deal, Kath. It's a huge fucking deal. There's got to be something else that can take us down there. The Dunbat at Theta was the only vessel that could take that pressure, and you saw what happened. Then think of something else. Simon, please. You don't have to switch this instant. Just play along for now. If we find something else, then great. If not... I'm not promising anything. Thank you, Simon. Have a look around the room. This is where they would keep the power suits, if there are any left. They normally tell me if something comes up, so I'm concerned. Yeah, that's a bit... It's a bit worrying. Power suit tests are ready. Jasper confirms. Archer scans are in the arc. Catherine was here. Load equipment and extra radiation. Climate away. Crane operations are ready. What are you waiting for? Find um, a power suit and let's get on with it. Shush, lady! I am looking around the room. <laughs> Only can Stanley Wife will pick up in two days. All of them in the suits? Wait, are we gonna, like, find her dead body or something? Oh, I think I've seen this one before. Simon, look for a suit in the lockers. Catherine, I will get to it when I want to. <laughs> There's only one left by the looks of it, but let's make sure. Oh! Oh no, I thought it was locked. It's not. What are you waiting for? Find a power suit and let's get on with this. No power. power suits there's a dead woman inside at least i think it's a woman just like the body we found in the annex she's missing her head gross this could work in our favor though look for a terminal nearby see if you can boot it up this terminal Power suit granted to withstand temperatures spanning from 50 degrees to minus 75 while we'll keeping a steady 40 on the inside. The suit will automatically shield the wearer from pressure and maintain the novel on ATM up to a depth of wow, 5,000 meters. Wow. The onboard controller monitors the wearer's physical state and is able to minimize risk of shock, hyperventilation, and even dehydration. The suit is easily assembled uh, through rotating neck and wrist rings that lock the gloves and helmet in place. Note that the joints won't seal unless the controller is able to identify a wear through a set of sensory systems. Suit may be locked to specific personnel, but as a default, the suit will accept anyone. Okay, good to know. The controller is the onboard computer the monitoring pulse, brain activity, body temperature, and stress through skin conductance. It uses the information to provide the wearer with the safest experience. Okay. 
Tracking. Climber station. And Omnicron. Oh, and Tau. So some got stuck at the climber? What pod is it? Oops. Pod. Great A material. Don't write it off just yet. Remember what we found out at Theta. The suit you are wearing is basically just a cortex chip working a few pints of structure gel, powered by the on suit battery pack. And a dead collar, Imogen Reed. Exactly. If you think about it, we're actually incredibly lucky. We found a suit with an already dead body inside. I guess you're right. What about the wow? What makes you think it'll play along? It's not magic, it's algorithms. A set pattern. The WoW won't be able to deny us, even if it was capable of wanting to. I'm still not crazy about this plan. It feels wrong. Please, Simon. I can't give up on the Ark. I need this to work. So we need a Cortex chip, structure gel, and a battery uh -huh, I have to find things. This one hell of a no. Thanks. I'll just hang around here if that's okay. I'll be back. Uh, no. So what is it? Cortex chip. Power source. Body temperature. I mean, that's will be me. Wait, I said free things. Skin galvanic. I don't know what that is. Come on, we need to get a cortex chip, a battery pack, and some structure gel. Okay, talk chip, battery, and gel. Chip battery gel, okay. Oh god, there's gonna be friends in here. Oh, is that the water underneath? I didn't notice that before. I don't wanna go. Can I not go? <laughs> Can I stay here? It's all open now. It's sounding very ominous. How will I know when I found it, you know? She's turned all the lights on. I do not like that. Pressure. Pressure chamber. Okay, I guess nothing's here. Hello? Anyone here? Please no. Please. <gasps> ah! I know. Uh. talking please stop talking to me <laughs> power room 
workshop, maybe this is where the chip is? Let's go upper first. Can we go upper? What the heck? We suffer? room laboratory so that's not open is a little healy healy is there anything in here Ooh. got some rats and some some other things We need to heal, right? We we don't need to. Not yet. <laughs> Lovely. I guess there's nothing here. I just checked the drawers. Oh, there it is. Ross and the Wow confirmed a correlation between the overloaded systems and the corpse of Dr. Ross. It was able to shield off the corpse inside the glass jar for a couple of seconds and witness a massive drop in the readings. If we really have to keep Ross inside Omnicron, I suggest finding a way to erect a permanent barrier to avoid severe system malfunctions. Oh. Well, is definitely repairing Ross corpse. Oh. It's the most insane thing I have ever encountered. Somehow the WoW primarily elegated to the structure gel inside the walls is bombarding the corpse with every system it can access. The glass jar is surrounded by an unhealthy amount of Electris uh, electromagnetism and radiation, which seems to be instructing gel and already stuck inside Ross's body. Not sure, not not sure, but not not sure what the WoW expects expects to happen when it's restored. But at least all the crazy should stop when the body hits a hundred percent. Oh. The game is having a hard time with things. Was there anything back here I couldn't access before? No, that's where I came from. Okay. Ah! Oh! Hydroponics. Wait, no, I don't think I went in there, did I? No. Oh. Ugh. What is happening? What is happening? Okay, so there's nothing in these rooms. Okay. Ah! Dude, stop it! <laughs> stop it, please! Biomech laboratory. Oh. Uh, so we're gonna go upper or lower first? Lower is a bit smaller. Maybe I go lower? Take... Take the gel? Wait, you want me to go down? Huh. Okay, let's go lower first if we can. Wait, where would the lift be? 
I don't I don't really understand. I do not. Hmm. Oh my god. Too many noises. Uh wait, is this not a lift? No, it's not. Oh. How do I go down? Oh I use the stairs! Oh my god, I'm stupid. <laughs> Uh, I don't remember there being doors though, but you know, that's fine. Oh. Yeah, everyone's head exploded. That's crazy. Is it just me or do I hear someone breathing? I definitely hear someone breathing. Decontamination room? Yeah, yeah, I think it is. The structure jar has been charged and actually keeps going for a while, even when removed from a power source. If applied to circuits, it seems to help out the connectivity. Uh, it seems like it's not only connectivity, but even functionality. <laughs> well, what did it say? Get the virus? What virus? What? The jar can make simple machinery work and act more efficiently. However, the modifications that the WoW has made to the jar are full of extra... I hate that breathing in the background. Um, has made the gel are full of extra information that doesn't necessarily make sense. When applied to something more complicated, it causes the gel to act like a cancer upon the host, eventually ruining it. We could use the gel to our advantage, but it needs to be un. I didn't read that one. I'm sorry. <laughs> to get rid of bad codes. Uh, apply gel to dead mouse. The gel caused the mouse to appear alive. It was put into the same habitat as a living mouse. The reanimated mouse was apathetic while the living one seemed stressed. Oh. After 50 minutes, the reanimated mouse attacked and killed the living mouse. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Half an hour later, the reanimated mouse stopped moving. The co oh. Did you say listen to me? What if I don't want to listen to you? What the heck? Uh, the corpse was solid as a gel hard, had hardened within it. Oh, interesting. Interesting. I, I wonder if it attacked it because of the stress or something, though, with the gel hardening. Reanimated another mouse with structure gel. This time it was done with uh, something gel as produced by someone else. Stop the wow. Wait, someone's telling me to stop the wow? Huh? The results were impressive. The thing appears catatomic, uh, but it's more of a sleepwalker. To avoid the thing hardening as before, electromagnets were used to cause a low electrical current within the animal. This has also provided us with the ability to somewhat control it. Oh, interesting. The structure gel remains unchanged. Destroy the well. What are you talking about, dude? Why are you saying this? Um, the structure gel remains unchanged on a fundamental. Un oh my god, I can't speak, guys. I'm so sorry. Um, it's still the same cross link gel with aligned graphene in a <laughs> polyunsaturated matrix that was installed throughout Paphos 2 a few years ago. The problem is not. Sorry, I, I missed that one again. Is this something nightmare? I I have no clue what you're talking about. Um, but it's controller the WoW. Um, the gel has not taken on any new properties. The WoW simply uses it in ways. Oh my god, <laughs> uses it in ways that we would never even have dreamed of. Oh my gosh, overwhelming overwhelming evidence concludes that all deformed creatures, the fish, the sharks, and even the helpers were manipulated by the WoW. Dude, stop saying listen to me! Dude, I'm trying to read! Um, blah, blah, blah. Uh, they are, they have in some manner been exposed to charged gel and in turn stricken by a cancerous growth that affect their whole being. It's difficult to ask why ask why when talking about the NAI, but it all started shortly after the comet killed the surface. I can't for sure say if it's bad code or carefully programmed mercy killing, 
but it looks like it's not going to make things easier for us to survive. Look, stop the well. Yes, I get it. I get it. <laughs> Hello. Uh, huh? I'm, yeah, some science. I know, right? My lord. Gel. I think that's what I'm about to get by the looks of it. Status. Open. <gasps> oh my lord. But that's the gel I need. Need a new one? Control ship malfunction. You finally heard from her? That's good. Hopefully she's okay. Dispense gel. Oh, am I putting gel on it? working oh cool wait oh it's so big oh hello huh interesting So what am I doing here? I thought I was going to use this, but I'm not. doing guys do I have to go find one oh structured gel as connector and interface between energy bar and organic tissue never seen something of that speed stop stop with the static Is it not this? Hello? Did I do it wrong? Alright, well, I guess not. Alright, well... Control chip. Okay, maybe we can find one downstairs or something? What is this? Oh, interesting. Ooh. I don't like that how it's going into the eye. Uh, said that work was long. Had doctor's appointment afterwards. And fell asleep when she got home. Aw. I feel like... She should have really messaged you to say that she was busy. But I guess that's what happens sometimes. Oh, what is this? Lovely. Okay, sorry, can I see? Nope. Oh, is that growing? Ooh. Something at something something Vader? No death phase. Second. Check previous results. Okay, well, let's go down then. Um, I really hope I didn't miss something here.
Okay, so let's go downstairs. Oh, this is working. What is this? And usually sedated orange rough, rough, what? Rough, roughy? <laughs> I don't know what that word is. Found hovering outside the Omicron substation. It had a remarkable bone growth that seemed to interfere with its perception. Bought it inside to study it, but it stiffened and died in the process. During post-mortem study, the thing kicked back to life while being out of water. It kept swimming for a few minutes, so I returned it to the aquarium. It instantly started banging into the glass and plunged itself to death before I could relocate it. Oh my lord. Darby and someone, Waldeck, identified it as what was sub sabotaging the Lamar probe at about 900 meters depth. It's a 150 centimeter long rubber fish, or well, rudder fish, sorry. It looks like it has emerged with some other kind of fish or shark. It's the freakiest form of mutation we've seen so far. It's clear that it is getting worse. Something is causing this and I'm not buying the brewery. I wrote... What was that? Radioactive fallout nonsense that Orvari can't shut up about. Okay. Oh. <sighs> Ross dead on arrival. The dead man found on the climber this morning has been identified as Johan Ross, the I, the AI. I, oh my god, I, I'm reading way too much. Working at Tal, I can't even begin to imagine what has happened down in the abyss, and frankly, I won't risk losing my stuff by going down there to look. If the ARC team is alive, which I highly doubt, they will have to find a way to give us a sign. We're not going down there again without good reason. Oh. Looks like they died anyways, but okay. Was this open before? Oh, this is the way I came from. Oh, is there another room here? Yes. Oh, no. Oh, we did want to go up first, so... Uh, I'm scared. I feel like up is the scary part. There's totally something in here. I can feel it. No, not friends. I don't, I don't want to. Also, uh, said she feels horrible. I don't know if she means about a plan or if she means that she feels sick. Oh. I hope it's about the plans. Hello? Anyone here? Maybe we're fine. Maybe there's no one. Aqua is friends. I, I hope so. I hate the rumbles. I hate the rumbles. Main entrance. Oh, is this where we were before? Oh, no. Ah, uh, there's no point touching them because they have no heads. Were they trying to get out? And sometimes food. <laughs> yes, yes. A hundred percent. Oh god. Alright, well, okay, that's that. Do I bother touching them? I don't know. Yeah, no. Oh, their heads are kaput, so I can't hear anything. I came from there, right? Oh, because this doesn't look ominous at all. That's where we were just then. Okay. I gotta override this part. I didn't do this part, did I? I thought I did. <laughs> I like how 
my ducks straight away. Uh, I'm scared. <laughs> that room is a crime scene that I would thoroughly hate to investigate. Oh, yeah. Why are all their heads exploded? Why were they in the entrance room? Were they trying to escape? You know, like that kind of thing. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, dude, I'm sorry to say, but I think your head exploded. <laughs> uh, sorry, excuse, excuse me. Oh, God, sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Johan Ross was found dead on crime this morning. The ARC team went down a couple of days ago, but I see no reason to suspect them playing a part in his death. The climber can't be operated from the abyss, so there was a scheduled retrieval. The climber returned with only the lifeless body of Alpha member Johan Ross. No traces of the ARC team. Cameron Eames Lansky. All studying the body inside containment. I'll follow up with whatever they find. Delenda Est. Delenda. The WoW has been getting more aggressive, pushing all systems to their limits. Ironically, the dead Dr. Johan Ross would be the perfect person to ask why the WoW is making such a big buzz about his passing. After all, the WoW isn't supposed to want anything. And definitely not to mourn people. Hmm. The system overload affects the staff considerably. Headaches, loss of sleep, unwarranted stress. And it seems to be getting worse. I could use some advice if you can get through. Delenda the Est. Oh. Things are out of hand. The staff looks like they're about to explode. Every other person walks around with nosebleeds, and the rest keep wiping stains of blood from their eyes to keep them from overflowing. Oh my god. It's to do with the WoW trying to free Ross somehow for sure. At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if the body just got up and left. Rally Herber, our dispatcher, has been snooping around asking questions she shouldn't. She says she's going down into the abyss to find Alpha. I can't bring myself to stop her. Oh. Uh. No! <laughs> that was her head! Oh, God! Send? What am I sending? Interesting. Recordings, documents. Oh no, not more reading. Tower evacuation. On September 13th, ordered the staff to tower to evacuate and move to the plateau. Together with Engineer Allen, I descended into the abyss to assist the evacuation. Following pro protocol, we waited for the climber platform for 140 minutes and made several attempts to contact Tau. I decided to move towards the site, thinking I might intercept them. That's when I noticed the guiding lights flickering and soon the whole path shut down. Oh no. Omega sector swallowed by darkness. I pushed on with my floodlight until I heard screaming over the short range radio. It carried on, breaking in and out of range. As I hurried closer to investigate, I came upon the lacerated body of field worker Espinosa. Espinosa, I love that name. Uh, something big had uh, almost cut her in two. Oh god, I consider considered the importance of saving Tao and more sp specifically Ross as I heard Espinosa's colleagues getting massacred over the radio. Seeing no way to possibly improve the situation, I hurried back to the climber and left the people at Tao to their fate. Oh my lord. Oh my lord, wait, who is this? That is a very nice name. I know, right? Espinosa. I don't know why, it's such a cool name. Uh, with some luck, Ross made it back to Tau and is able to continue his work at Alpha. To avoid further disturbances, I have decided to report the evacuation as a complete failure, hoping it will stop Fader from attempting another one. Claudia, the manager of Omnicron, has already ordered the climber to stay at the plateau for now. My report on the savage wildlife scared everyone enough to stop Waldeck and Darby from maintaining the Lamar probes. 
it's a good thing Velasky is offside because I have a feeling he would not have approved. The restrictions came out slightly more severe than I had anticipated, but I'll take it. As long as Ross is left alone to work with the WoW. Interesting. Did Ross become one with the WoW or something? Julia, Johan, Ross, and Mark. Serang. Oh. Okay, images. I don't know what this is about. Oh, what is that? Okay. Well, who were you? <laughs> who, who were you? That's my question. Um, any food? Any food? I'm starving. I haven't eaten at all. Um, oh, yum! Look at this! I'll slap that up. <laughs> uh, what is this? Spinach? Rice? Oh, do you want some? Let's make some rice with some curry and some noodles. Oh, and some beef. Yum. Let's go. <laughs> Oh dear. All right. Bunch prints. Oh my god. It actually like prints it. No way. And it came up to that. That's that's funny. All right, I'm going to take this with me. All right. This is my snack for the day. And if I see someone, I can be like, here, have the snack. <laughs> Eat this instead. Don't kill me. <laughs> Here you go, I bought some food. I don't think anyone's here, guys. Um. Ew. Oh, there was a save. Why was there a save? Storage. I see nothing. I bring food. sure there's a friend in here. I'm scared. Is this how I get back out? Oh god. I'm not ready. Oh yeah, that's definitely a thing. Guys, what do I do? Ah! Nope. I see him. I see him. where I need to go. Are you good, dude? Is that what I need to touch? What do I do? Work? No? 
say how me. Guys, I don't know what to do. Do I go up to it? I'm too scared, I'm too scared, I don't even know if I got the thing I wanted to get. <sighs> oh my god! Okay. Okay, did I? Did I look everywhere up there? Oh my god, she scared me. Oh my god, she scared me. Oh my god, or he, I'm so sorry, I don't know what you are. <sighs> okay, I think that was the power chip. Can I find out what I grabbed? Maybe. Run, yes. Oh my god, I did not like that. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, maybe I don't know yet. I don't know what I grabbed. We need to get you a new Cortex chip, just like the ones you find inside robots, so we can store your brain. Okay, I think I did get it, maybe. Alright, I need to go down. Oh man, that was scary. I did not like that. Uh, I still didn't get the structured out gel. I feel like I was meant to, but I don't know. BRB, okay, Carrie. I'll be here. <laughs> okay, let's go back down. floor listen to me what ah. okay so now we're gonna get the chip from another robot of some sort person there. Wait, their head's not exploded. Robot repair bay. This sounds like somewhere I would get a chip. Oh, I gotta get it from this. Okay, 
maybe we do this last? I don't know. Hello? Yeah, I know. We'll do this first. <laughs> Motor, comms. Eject. Huh? Down? Wait, no. Maybe it needs to, like, go down? I don't really get it. Um... You know what? I'll be back. I'll be back. Hello? Interesting. This door is locked. Is this gonna open? <laughs> Just in case. You never know. I, I don't need the healies, I'm good. Take the gel to Alpha? Into the Abyss, take it into Alpha. In the Abyss. Oh. Alpha needs medicine. Is sick? Okay, this guy is a bit crazy. The heart of Alpha? Oh. That's the gem? Let's listen to these. Strasky, are you there? I hear you, Herbie. What's up? Uh, just wanted to check in. I have to go do something. I might not be around for a few days, okay? Well, you heard we're leaving the listening post? Must be important. It is, Strask. It is. Okay, then. Stay safe. Omicron, can you hear us? Loud and clear. Everyone all right? We'll be as soon as we make friends with the power suits. I'm sure you'll get used to it. I just wanted to check in before we pass the last word from Lumar Pro. Guys, any last words to Omicron? Don't forget to pick us up. You uh, heard that, right? Don't worry, we won't forget. All right, heading into radio silence. Good luck, guys. Tau, please respond. This is Rally Herber calling from Omicron. Please respond, Tau. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Oh. ECR. Why do I get fit the feeling that something's gonna come out of this room? Psst. Am I gonna have to run again? <laughs> Alright guys, how do we do this? How do we do this? What do you think? Thank you. 
I heard something move. Diagnostics. Um. Uh, what does this mean? What does this mean? Does this mean nothing goes through here? Is that what that is? Maybe not? Oh, I don't know, guys. What does this mean? There's nothing that tells me how to do it. No. Anything in the bin? Hello? <laughs> I can't read it. Oh, I don't know, guys. I don't know. I wish it would, like, light up if it was correct or something, you know? I thought they all had to, like, touch each other, but maybe not. Um... So this goes in, and then these go out. So I just needed to go to the three at the bottom. But then also reach that one. This is still not working. Um, okay, guys, I think I'm a little bit stuck. I think I'm stuck. Where is... Okay. Uh... Uh... 
The objective of this puzzle is to get the lasers from the left side of the receiver, receivers on the bottom by changing the nine shapes. Nine shapes. <gasps> oh! Okay. Okay, I will stop looking at that now that I've figured out something. <laughs> I'm sorry, are you okay? Oh, see, now we're getting it. Okay. I didn't know you had to click on that! Guys, why wouldn't they tell me that? <laughs> what? Poison the well? Why would I poison the well? Hello? I just need to get the gel. The gel is the last thing. So, uh, where was the gel room again? Over here? Yeah. Okay, let's, let's look in here again. Let's have a... Let's try to figure out what we need to do. tell me these things. Now what? Do I have to lock it or does it not matter? What do I do now? Oh! Oh. Yeah. 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 Is that good enough? Right, good enough. It's having a little piss on it, you know? Oh! Ew! Look at it! Ew! Are we good? Eh, yeah, I'm... I'm a part of it. Close the door. Oh, it, it wouldn't let me close. Never mind. <gasps> yeah! We did it, guys! Got it! Drink it? Ew. No, I don't want to drink it. Alright, now what's going to come at me? I've got everything now. No, no, no. Ah! 
monsters we have everything we need right oh yeah. let's get to work oh my gosh that was scary okay 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 ew it's crazy don't worry it'll work Make sure it's all bunched together with the structure gel connecting all the parts. All right, try activating the suit from the terminal again. I can't believe we're doing this. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? I was going to suggest that if you refused. You'd go without me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it? Change body? Yes. If you want to stay here, I'm not going to stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. What would be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right. Let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. Oh no. Oh no. I. Oh no. I remember. I don't like this. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current Cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. You lost me halfway there. <laughs> you don't really need to understand it. Just make them line up. to the normal me here because there'll be two of me oh no no indians thought photos would steal their souls in this case they'd be right <laughs> oh god i hate it oh god It worked. There must be something wrong. Can't you run a diagnosis or something? Uh. No, I could just. Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works. You know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The same <sighs> thing in the seat was copied, and now. You are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God damn you, Kath. Two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were going to take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. How did you expect me to react to this shit? Please stop. You're fucking disgusting. Oh, dude. What's going to happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in this fucking nightmare again? All alone? So cool. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if... What if he didn't need to wake up? You do that? Uh, um, yeah. Maybe. I'd do it. There. I set it up for you. Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in anymore. I feel like we shouldn't leave him here. I feel like he's gonna wake up. Kef 
boyfriend's gonna be gone, the suit's gonna be gone, he's gonna know that we've left him behind. He's gonna wake up and he's gonna be all alone in this place, stuck. I... Personally... I think it's unfair. I feel like we should... Kill me. It's me, right? I don't... Oh god, this is why... <laughs> Oh, man. Like, is it me making this choice? Or is, is this, like, actually another person, technically? Like, oh, man. Wait, what did you set up? Uh, on the other terminal. Uh... Do I do it? I feel really sad, but I feel like I'd feel sad, sadder, like, leaving him to wake up. I'm sorry, me. I just feel like this is the best situation. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Breathing is getting slower. Mm. I'm sorry, me. But if I was you, I would not want to wake up to this again. Oh, man. Oh, Catherine, yeah, man. Oh. the climber oh look at the abyss guys that was dark that is one dark sea What do I do here? Oh. Wait, is there a button? No? Did I miss something? There's another way. Okay. Maybe it's this one? Oh, there's some fishies. Is this one here? Yeah, here we go.
that even possible? Maybe there's some kind of afterlife. Do you think my place is taken? The real me died like a hundred years ago. Is there still room for me? And what about the Simon I killed at Omicron? Mm. What do you think, Catherine? Is there a heaven full of redundant copies of the same people? Is there someone up there who called me an imposter? It's dumb luck, right? That I woke up in the right body. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away in Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right sign. Yeah. Christ. This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind. Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Mm. Please say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I could still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I had never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the seat. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the yard, would it be any different? still be alone. No friends. No family. You could make new friends. I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have... Oh, that's not good. Catherine? Catherine? Hello, Catherine. What happened? I go up. <gasps> look at it. Oh, my God, look at them. <gasps> it's so pretty. Pretty fish. I wish they went blurry. My god. Hey, I know it's not much, but why are we stop moving? The power blacked out for a moment. I think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry. It should hold. Comforting. It Co will hold. when you're not powered? Time feels omitted. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. 
and I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes, but generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. It's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. That'd be the worst. <laughs> Oh, my vision is going. Oh, that's not good. What is that? You did it. You did it. Excuse me? Excuse me? Oh, did I like black out? From the pressure, I might have blacked out, which is kind of weird because I'm not a human, but okay. Also, whether you mean I'll make preparations, um. Oh, good, you're back. What happened? Something dropped onto the cage, knocks you right out. You spoke to me. Looks like a man, one of WoW's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. It said it would make preparations. I don't like the sound of that. It was very strange. I thought it was going to kill you for sure. Glad it didn't. Yeah, me too. No, it wants me. That's the problem. Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good. Not sure the climber could take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach town. You haven't been here before? Not in a way that'll help us. Wait, the of you has been here. We're following your old footsteps, Cap. When I had footsteps. You could still be down here somewhere, technically. Don't remind me, it freaks me out. <laughs> Alright, let's head for town and find that arc. I have a feeling you might be dead though, you know? Everything's quite blurry. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. I hate that everything's so blurry. Collection, physical checkups, check, tower evacuation, fails, bring the octopi. Is there a storm under the sea, huh? Is that how that works? It is very dark. Oh, is it touchy touchy? Tao? Come in, Tao. Please answer, Tao. Nothing. It's dead. Let's move out. We'll try the next one. Okay, I need to make sure I find all of those. Um. No other touchy touchies before I keep going. Is 
this? Okay. Nothing. Oh, the blurriness, man. The blurriness. Fault line activity. Strong torrent expected. Oh, no. Observatory. TVFD. Tau. Not good. That's so it is an actual storm under here. That's fun. All right, stick to the lights, yeah. Jesus, did you see that? Stick to the lamp lights, they won't go near them. I can't, foul glasser. It's important I reach Omicron. Our future depends on it. Calm down. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you to tell Julia Dahl that the WoW is out of control. She needs to get to Sarang. He'll know what to do. Raj, you can tell him yourself. We just need to pick up the pace, okay? Glass! We lost the path! We need to go back! I know where to go. Come on! Oh god. It's over there! The light is over there! Final push for us. Almost there, we just- Oh god. Not cool. Not cool. Wait, so this light wasn't on? Oh, I guess the power was off. Oh, they were so close to... Damn. Blue leads to towel, red leads to climber. Okay, so we're going blue, blue lights. Lovely. 700 meters. Oh, I love this. I'm going to die to a fishy fishy. So if I turn uh, that doesn't really look like red, but yeah, you know what? Yeah, sure. I can see it on the floor, anyways. What are the red lights? Just lights? <laughs> Fuck no. Oh, hell no. Can I, like, go up on the edge? <laughs> Hell no! Well, that's the thing that killed them, I guess. So I can die here. Oh, God.
blue. Maybe that's where I came from. Oh god, how do I... Oh god! It didn't work! It broke! Is there anything else in here, or is that it? Oh, Healy Healy's! Is that in case I get hit by the shark, or what? Also, am I hurt? Maybe I'm hurt. Let's have a, let's have a gander. I don't think I got hurt, but just in case. You never know. Alright, well that doesn't work, and I think... Oh, this might have one more thing. Ooh. Squid. Anglerfish. Era. Oh. Oh, is that an anglerfish, I wonder? Right, well, there's no lights. Am I just going into the abyss? What's happening? Oh, the lights have stopped working. Oh. This is awkward. Do I go back? I surely I don't go back. You know what? It's fine. I'll be fine. Maybe I have to fix the power or something? Um, no? Oh! I see the lights! Thank God! Hello! Oh my lord! see shit. There might be a fish around here wanting to kill me. Why is it green? Is that the light?
stuck with it. <laughs> uh, is this Freddy 2.0? <laughs> I hate this. I absolutely hate this. If you get knocked down, I'm dead. <laughs> going in here. I see a light dead ahead. <gasps> oh god, I'm dead! Oh god, I should have run the other way. What the fuck? Are we good? I guess so. Oh, I hate this, guys. I absolutely hate this. Alright, so don't go near the light. Got it. My bad. <laughs> Oh, we 
we're going in the building. Oh, man. Are you I'm sure about that? Are you sure about that? I'm not happy to be inside. Dive room. Hmm. Looks like something came out of there. Just, just maybe. <laughs> just maybe. These are locked. Okay. Oh, there's a touchy, touchy thing. Yes, I like touchy, touchy things. Not to be weird or anything. Welcome to Tau. What's left of it? Are you guys alright? What happened here? We ran out of real food long ago. People have been getting sick. Haven't heard from anyone in months. No shit. They all think you're dead down here. Some failed evac story circulating at Omicron. Oh, God. Listen, son. We're on an important mission, and we need your help to operate the Omega space gun. When it's done, we can all head back up the plateau. But now we need to get moving. Of course. Head on through to the habitat. We shut off the front section to preserve power. All right. See you soon. Hmm. Okay. Lost signal. Suit free is act <laughs> is active. Oh yeah, I, I already I already knew that. Um, <laughs> access log. Um, welcome back, Carrie. No, that's fine. No worries. Well, they all... Okay, yeah, somewhat... The, the suit is definitely alive, that's for sure. I love this. <gasps> Yonko! Hi, Yonko! Oh, my lord. I hear sounds. I'd be scared. Oh, it's saving. <gasps> you died in the cult? No, Yonko! Did I survive? Am I still living? <laughs> Is this gonna close? No? What is happening? I don't... I don't understand what's happening. I caused you to die! No, Yonko, I'm so sorry! Service station. Oh. oh no, I'm sorry, Yonko. Okay, let's have a look. There's some crosses. Wow, really far away from me. Okay. Oh, there's gonna be something down here. I'm scared. Okay, so it's at the very end. Uh, that's room is... Okay. Uh, so those are the zones I can't walk in. Right, so we gotta go through here. That means the monster's somewhere in here, I bet ya. Do we eat your body? I hope not. Oh my gosh. 
that would be a thing that would happen though, wouldn't it? In a cult, right? <laughs> you eat your <laughs> your f fellow fellow friends. I don't know. I got put in the corner. No. Oh my dear lord, what is this? A yummy room by the looks of it. Yum yum. I agree, unacceptable. Oh god. <laughs> I'm just gonna stand back here. <laughs> they wrapped you up and put you in the corner? Oh no. Hello? You know they opened that door. Oh my god. Okay, I don't think you can open doors. I hope not. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Power site info. Open the freaking door. 
Oh my god, don't make a sound. Oh shoot. Did I do it? Wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh shoot. Is there anything in here? Poison the imprint? Well, more than the gel entity. Oh shoot. Oh shoot! Hi! Hi, are you coming in? Hello! Hi, friends! Um, okay, bye bye! Um, guys, what do I do? I don't remember the map. Do I go. I go right, right? I go... <gasps> Which way are you going? Oh my god. Dude, I hate you. I hate you so much. No! We're gonna do a roundabout. Come on. Come on, good. Come on. Come on, friend. We're gonna go around the roundabout. No, I can't. <laughs> Don't go, I can't fight back. <sighs> I can't close it. Oh shoot, I saw him. Go up, go up, go up! <laughs> Is this the way I'm going? fight back no no I can't fight I, I just have to run <laughs> oh shoot we're going down again okay I think I made it I'm not too sure Ow! oh my lord hello oh my god I'm scared <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> oh, I think I can breathe, guys. I think I can breathe. <gasps> stop what? The wow? I know you want to stop the wow. You say that a lot. Alright. Why can't we go in Ross's room? So this one is... No one's room. Show no fear. I... Um, guys? Is that thing moving? Move on, son. What do you mean, move on? Oh. My. God. I think you're right. Maybe I do move on. Um, but I want to... Are you going to kill me if I go near you? Okay, no, I don't think we do that. <laughs> Alright, thank you. <laughs> Just closes the door. We have to leave. Why do we have to leave? Oh my god, what's this guy talking about? Can we do anything for him? No. We're out of sedatives. If we had a gun, this would be the time to pull it out. Did not expect it to end like this. Should have jumped the climber back to Omicron. Oh. Without the Ark? Forget about the Ark. No, you don't get to say that. It's the only thing left of value. You know that. Yeah, yeah. Promise you won't leave it behind. We'll all be dead one day. Then what? Well, better keep it safe until then. Don't want the wow to take it, swallow it whole. I'm sorry, Catherine. 
Oh. It's okay, Ian. Just let it out. Let it all out. Oh? What do you mean, go give him a high five? I think he's gonna kill me if I go near him. Squeeze me. Squeeze! So, so that was Ian? By the sounds of it? Oh god. The sun? Oh, you are still alive. Oh my gosh. Catherine? What the fuck did we do? Hey, try not to think about it. My whole life, I've been a good man. We messed up, Sarah. There, there. I should have launched. Taken the chance. There's time. If Ashkin says we could try again, when things calm down. You gotta do it, you know. You got to. <laughs> oh God, they all died here. Oh God, he's got like, Something coming out of his nails. Oh, <laughs> sorry. I can't. I can't. Ugh. What? What do you want? Oh, this is the bathroom. Anything in here? Toothbrush? <laughs> Toilet? Rubbish? Shower? I have a shower. What's your plan? Alright, let's go up here, I guess. I don't know. This is locked. Remotely locked. Okay. Oh, someone's actually there. That's interesting. going. Five... Where are we going, guys? Did I go in here? I... I can see that. Wasn't there someone in dispatch? I think it was the infirmary. Oh... Oh, maybe. I'm too sure. Okay, let's... You know what? Let's go dispatch. I think I called the infirmary. Oh, but there is something in here. Okay. Oh, what was this? Oh, my dear lord. I do not think I can read this. Uh, yeah, I forgot this exists. Um... Minor structural damage, radio knocked out, communications recovered, Omnicron and the rest of Aphos 2 are all right. Crossite radio failing, Luma. Probes keeps using the link. Urgent fix needed, Tau can't retrieve the climber until the link is working. Visited by SSE will check. Maybe I'm just crazy. No, no, I think you're right. I think it was the infirmary. Because when I tried to go in there, someone talked. So I think that's what that one is. System of 
weekly with this establish and tool communications Uma back at 100 percent evacuation of tau ordered we're all leaving for omnicron swarmed by monsters and no radio with oh no yeah so they're all just stuck here oh no does this have anything no i can't open this okay Man, this game gives me shivers. Um, Upsilon. Lambda. Anyone at Phi? No. Mega? No. These two, no links, so nothing. Door locks. Oh, I need a number? I unlocked infirmary. So I could do that. Exit to five. Oh, okay. So that's where I need to go. Okay. Is there a number? Push to call lift. Like. Oh. Interesting. Dried skin, pure paste, okay. Any numbers? No. Am I meant to like remember the number? Let's say hello to our friend again. Hello! <laughs> hey. Are you gonna attack me? Oh, no, I don't like that sound. Okay, I don't think there's anything there anyway. So we're good. What was this again? No, there's nothing in there. No numbers, no nothing. So, what now? Hmm. I guess I can't get into Ross's room yet. Let's go to the infirmary. I've unlocked it now. Alive. You. You're different. Oh my. My me. Oh my god. Wow. She's. Nice suit. Used to have one just like it. Who is this? Ox status running. Oh. Are you human? Sarah Lindwall. Payload technician at your service. A rare sight, am I right? I'd say so. You're the first normal living human I've seen. There's not many left down here. Most of them are up on the plateau. You mean at Omicron? Yeah. There's no one alive at Omicron. You've been there? I've been all over. Power plant at Upsilon, the ruins of Lambda, the abandoned Delta, Theta. You've been to Theta? There's not a lot left of Pathos, too. And uh, I'm the only living person you've met. <coughs> you mean I'm the last living human on the planet? I'm sorry. Who are you again? Simon Jarrett. Stationed out? Nowhere. I used to work in a bookshop in Tehran. Long story. Then what the hell are you doing here? I'm trying to find the Ark. Why would you? How do you know about that? I've heard it's the last hope for mankind. Damn right it is. Now what do you want with it? Take it to the gun at Phi. Launch it into space. That was the plan, all right. I 
been guarding it ever since we brought it back to town. I just couldn't bring myself to let go. To tell you the truth, I don't have the strength to argue. And I certainly don't have the time to wait for the next sentient thing shuffling through here. Go ahead. Take it. Thank you. Can I get you anything? Do anything for you? You could kill me. Good one. I still can't believe I'm the last one. Uh, she actually means it. No, I... No, you can press that button yourself. Good to get this over with. Please don't leave me like this. Oh my god, if you I want me to... come, I would clean this place up a little bit. You actually want me to kill you? Is that what you want? Oh god. Be my guest. I got no secrets worth keeping. Thank you. Nope. Who was that? Ross? <laughs> Emergency flood? A thorough look at what com chemicals and compounds found pathos who could keep you alive in emergency situations. Nutrition through the vents? Oh, through the veins. A manual on how to keep unconscious, comatized colleagues fed through. Uh, if it's on how to make room for additional payload after the chasing has been constructed and left down to your last... Oh. Oops. Is that everything? Yeah, that was everything. Okay. Maybe she can't do it herself? Yeah, but I... Oh, I don't want to be responsible for her. This is literally the last, last human. Oh god, but she wants to die. Day 312? And I've pulled... Wow, I've just paused everyone's life on the... <laughs> Do we, do we do it? Are you serious about me killing you? No, I'd love to hang around here until I dry up to the size of a razor. Simon, this fucking sucks. <coughs> I don't want to live like this. Aww, man, I've killed so many things and people in this. I, oh, it's so hard. Fine. Uh, I'm so sorry. Mm, yes. Would you stay with me, please? Of course. It won't be long now. Just please, just stay. You want me to watch you die? Uh. <laughs> what a crazy thing this was. Life. Ah. Uh. At least I won't have to turn 30. Right. <laughs> You're not even 30? Oh my lord. Wish I could have died at home with my friends. Oh, yeah. You ever been to Greenland? It's very beautiful. Well, at least when you get out of the city. Nanok is busy, and yes, there's like 12 million people trying to get around, but it's a great place. Or rather, it was a great place before the comet ended it all. You know what? I prefer it this way. It's getting slower. I like to pay thoughts. Liked my colleagues, Ian, Nick, Jasper, even Catherine. Where is Catherine? People thought she was weird because she was quiet, but she was cool. Aww. Simon, 
you're still there. I'm here, sir. Don't let him die, okay? Send them out there. To the stars. Aww. She's gone. The black box is inactive. Probably found a way to switch it off. Oh man. So what, I just carry this thing around? No. Oh, I put it in here. Yeah, that makes sense. Should I send it to the dive room? That's where I'm going next, so... Okay. Oh, maybe I should call for it when I was down there. Oops. Think of it as granting her mercy instead of leaving her stuck where she is either with her either with her away or letting those things get her. That's very true, yeah. I know, I just it's so sad when, you know, you're in charge of someone living or dying. Um Oh yes, we opened Ross's room. Let's look in here. I was hoping to see Omnicron today. The evacuation ordered by the people at Fader was a gift, an excuse to leave Alpha and abandon the WoW. As the storm cleared, we were swarmed by monsters that the WoW had facilitated. We were ambushed and forced back towards Tau. Classic Wowski. I survive. All clear is in the infirmary, but that doesn't look good. Um, courtesy made a run for it to check observation for anything, a sibling, food. Going outside is beyond dangerous. It's like going to buy cigarettes in a hurricane. She came back and she had some crumbs with her. We all knew it was empty. I think she just wanted a chance to die without carrying the responsibility of taking it herself. Kiri, what are you doing? <laughs> no. Uh, people from the plateau showed up. It was a group of engineers from Veda telling us that they wanted to use a mega space gun to launch something called the Ark. It's an artificial. It's an artificial world that carries spring scans made from people working at Papos Two. The idea is silly but endearing. We all agreed to do a scan so we could take part in this afterlife. I'm trying not to cry, honestly. I know. It's so sad. Some of the engineers returned from Phi. Apparently they postponed the arc launch. They were all in a very firm mood and difficult to get any straight answers, answers from. Except from for one very important thing. They all wished to remain at Tau to figure this arc business out. But they had scheduled for the climber to pick them up tomorrow. Someone would need to catch that climber to alert Omnicron to what was happening. Luckily, Glacia and I were able to take on this mission. Oh, uh, I was finally, uh, I will finally get to to warn Dell and Sarang about the critical situation at Site Alpha. They never made it back. He was dead. The pattern has stopped evolving. The WoW has managed to find balance. I convinced SSE Volchek to turn off all external control systems, making the WoW our de facto caretaker. So far, it's exceeding expectations. Since the comet crashed a few days ago, 
January 12th. The WOW has dropped to a low energy state. It hasn't abandoned its duties. It's keeping climate and life support going. But it's been simplifying the pattern. Redefining its protocol. The WOW has started to grow physically. It's not just the core chamber. All around Pathos 2, structure gel is bursting through the pipes and bleeding through walls. I don't know what WoW could possibly stand to gain from this, but I assume it is intentional. The heart of WoW has claimed such a large part of the core chamber that there can no longer be any question to its heightened awareness. Not only does its expansion suggest an unexpected understanding of space, but also its own physical manifestation within the world. The WoW is reaching out to every machine, every life form, to manipulate, to control. It's trying to help save its creators from all this, just like the protocol demands. But really, what is good enough? Where is the line drawn for what is human and what is not? Would walking corpses do? Would a group of machines thinking they're human be acceptable? We can't trust a machine to know, to understand what it means to be. We have to terminate the WoW project. It can be done. I just need to get some help from Omicron. It's almost like Ross is speaking to me. Um... Ugh. Tentacles. Oh, some cards. Alright, I think that's it. What is this? Wow core? Aww. On the way to Fi. Oh, interesting. At Alpha? Okay. Well, that's everything. Let's go down. Let's hope there's not a monster waiting for us. Please no. <laughs> I'm scared. If I get whacked. Did you did you hear something? I heard something. By the way, I sent your friend request and sleep. Oh, okay. I will have to accept it. Okay. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm getting out of here. See ya. Oh my god, I'm stressed. Uh, I did indeed was gonna say it was my paranoia, but never mind. Oh! Wait, what do I need to do here? Waiting for cargo. Attach. So I follow this. Oh 
Uh, what do I need to do? Oh, there we go. Flood? Yeah. Is there another one? Oh, I need to pull all of them. Oh, God. <laughs> I think I hurt myself. I look kind of injured. Hopefully I'm okay. Did I get knocked out? Hello? Okay, we're awake. Hello. Alright. I need to... You got a flood? Yeah, I got a flood it. It's the airlock. <laughs> no, that's okay. <laughs> um, I need to go to the bathroom, but... Um, I also need to grab food, so I might take a little bit of a break here, um, but I'll keep the stream going and we'll come back and then we'll keep playing.